What's up guys, RJ Stolls here showing you guys how to use Shortcut 360. It is similar to Quick Boot 2.0, but this version is better because it gives you all the info from the default XCX, so you don't have to type it in. And what this does is it lets you launch your JTAG grips from uh, the dashboard. It creates that container for you. So first I'm going to open up Shortcut 360. And you need the default XCXs in the uh, Shortcut 360 folder. So I rename mine so I don't get them confused. So first you click those three dots down in the left corner and you choose which one you want to do. I'm going to do Batman and there's all the info. It even gives you the picture and then you type in the path. But for this one you don't need to do hard drive or USB. So I just delete mine after. It'll read it from either one so it makes things easier. So mine's just games, Batman and then default XCX. Then you hit OK. Alright, now for the next one, just for another example, I'm going to do Mortal Kombat. There it is. Gives you all the info, even the picture. And this one I'm going to put in JTAG grips, hacks, then Mortal Kombat, then default XCX. And you're separating it all by slashes, each path. So there's that one. Hit OK. And there's the two things, but it's not done yet. You have to go down to the bottom right and hit Create All, and it creates the shortcuts for you. Now they are stored under content there. I'm going to open up Horizon real quick since it takes a second to boot. And there's the shortcuts. It separates them by title ID. It's a really small file so it doesn't take up much room. And there they are. And to put them on your USB or hard drive, you just hit inject file. And then, yeah, it'll do it for you. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe. If you got any comments, just leave them down there and I can be sure to help. Thank you.